What's up guys, welcome back to another episode of Lisa the Painful RPG. Before we get started, I just wanted to apologize for the last video, because the game audio did not record, unfortunately. Uh, something went wrong with OBS, I'm not sure exactly what, but it won't happen again, it was my bad, I should have checked the recording before I started it. It was just kind of a mess and I'm really sorry about that, but anyway we're going to hop right back into it. So last time we were trying to get to a place where we could rest so we could gear up to take on that thing we saw earlier. Because we're going to need a moment or two. I don't think anything's going to happen. Never mind. You suffered a serious head injury. Your SP has decreased. Your luck has decreased. How unfortunate. He's knocked out cold. Well, at the very least, we're all healed up, so... Eh, you win some, you lose some. I'll take it. It's not that bad. Definitely one of the more tamer things that can happen to you in this game. So let's go and gear up. Not gear up, let's go and take on that uh, mutant we saw. And of course Brad gets, he gets withdrawals right when we're gonna go try to fucking kill this thing. Oh boy, alright. You son of a bitch, let's hit it. Alright. So for this guy, for skills, dropkick, probably just gonna want to be doing fireball, that's WSD. See if we can make it cry. We can go ahead and do this for Olan. And Olan can just do whatever. Damn. Ah, uh, it's crying. Okay, well, at least it kind of did, did what we wanted for us. Uh, let's see if you can... Do a cheer on Brad. You can increase Olan's TP again, and Olan can do a big shot. Okay, missed. Whew, good. Okay. Everybody just attack except Olan. You can do a big shot. Oh, we did it. We killed it. Alright. Not bad. Not bad at all. Everybody got a level up. Brad learned Machine Gun Fist, Cool Pose, Ghost Story, and Bomb Arrow. We got some joy. We can go ahead and sell that at the shop. You found a trash bag shawl. Let's check that out. Let's see, it's not really good. We we'll probably give it to Nern. Yeah, maybe Brad can take the Dany shawl. Oh. oh, yeah, I forgot. A shawl and a poncho are two different things. So Brad cannot wear those. He only wears ponchos. We need not go to the bar. Party member in there. We don't really need him. So we shall continue forth. Oh yeah, I don't think there's anything left for us in this area. So I wanted to go to a another place now that we have killed Punkert. Yeah, we won't be able to get over there until we get a bike. Now, we might be strong enough to go to the snake area. But there's also another area I wanted to go to. First, I want to save after that. That battle wasn't terribly difficult, but you know, it's still good to save after such a fight. So, if we go through here, should be the place I want to go to. 
Yeah. Oh wait, no. Never mind. I don't have the bike yet, so I can't do anything there. Uh, no. Was it through here? It might have been through here, yeah. Let's just walk all the way to the end of this cave. One of you assholes again. It's just everybody do a normal attack. I forgot Brad's joy deprived. Uh, what is it? Yeah, as you can see, we're so leveled up, those guys really don't give us anything anymore, so... It's probably best to just avoid them, if we can. So see if we can get to the end. Oh, right at the door, too. See if we can just escape. Nah, we can't escape. Yeah, whatever, asshole. Let's just get this over with. The XP and mags are surely nice, but you know, would rather just move on. Anyway, I think we wanted to go through here. Can't talk to any of these guys. Yo, where are you going? Get over here. Hey, Porky, leave him alone. Rando doesn't want us starting shit for no reason. I said get over here, now. What do you want? Got any business here? I'm just passing by. Just get out of here. You deaf? This place ain't for schoolboys. You don't fucked up. Well, shit. Let's see if we can take these assholes, alright? So. One of the things I wanted to do was machine gun fist. What is that? Wah wah. All right. Hints. You can do cool pose. Yeah, let's do cool pose. On carry. Topics. Discuss techniques. Do that on Olan. And bomb arrow on this big motherfucker right here. Oh shit. These guys hurt. Yeah, I should be targeting the big guys. The little guys, not really. Knuckle drop. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and use an item. Yeah, that bottle of soup. Use that. Skill with bomb arrow. Fuck it. Getting our asses beat out here. Yeah, Nern doesn't have anything terribly good. Yeah, see if we can scare this guy. Failed. God damn. Damn. We might we might not make it out of this one, boys, I'm not sure. Let's do a fireball WSD. Let's do a cheer on bread. Let's try to do discuss techniques on Olon and bomb arrow on the big guy. Oh, Nern's out. Alright, well, big guy's down, though. Shit. Ah, oh, damn it. Err. Hold up. Give the 
this bottle of soup to you. You can do knuckle drop. Bomb out. Damn it. Well, let's see if we can take these guys out with just these two. Alright, we won, but just barely. Alright. <laughs> Horse stance, it's a really good skill. Alright, well at the end of the day, I guess it kinda worked out. Hopefully there's a save point nearby, and hopefully a place where we could rest. Cause we got pretty fucked up, not gonna lie. <laughs> Creating a separate save file in case we just wanna go back and see what's over here. Brad stopped bleeding, that's good. I don't know if there's going to be any resting spots nearby. I hope there is. Because I could really fucking use one. I love this song. Reminds me of my youth. This is a perfect moment. I hope never nobody ever comes to ruins it. Oh. Well, hopefully we can take this guy. Guess we fucking can't. Oh, Brad doesn't have any SP. Or stance. Good night forever. I don't know, guys. I think I should probably try to head back and just fucking rest. Oh shit, I almost fell off of that. That would have been the enemy. Oh, I see that fucker with his deer over there. There's an item there. Fuck it. Ah. Cigarette. Oh, only place to go is here. Oh. The nice music is playing. Maybe there's a place to rest through here. Damn it. Uh, it's just Brad. Ooh. Yeah, I think this is gonna be the end. Please don't mess with my corpse. We are like barely even alive right now. We're not gonna talk to that guy. God damn it. Alright, fuck it. Alright, damn it. Uh, we're gonna head back, though. We're heading back, cause fuck this. I need some rest. Hopefully, we can rest at that place one more time and we don't get fucking murdered or something. Oh, uh, yeah, the fucking Cave of Doom. Come on, let's just get through here. Damn it. Uh. Alright, that's that. Let's just get through here. I don't want to deal with this anymore. Alright, good. We're back. Let's just hope we can rest at that place one more time, and hopefully nothing happens. Maybe he'll be awake by the time we are done. Yes. Everything's okay. Nothing happened. Great. We got lucky, it seems.
All right, we're good to go. Let's get out of here. Through the dark cave again. My back's killing me. I gotta stop sitting like this. Ugh. Gotta sit straight, kids. And it's not good having bad posture. Just go ahead and do this. Ain't nothing to it. Oh, Olan leveled up. Good. Alright, and now we can explore a little bit more due to our newfound ability of not having, like, two dead party members. Take that bottle. See if there's anything over here. Nah, doesn't look like it. Is this guy? Hold on, let's see if there's anything through here. Nah. Who are you? My name is Treats Needy. I'm a treasure hunter. Rumor has it that this cave has some sick loot hidden in it, but I just can't find it. Huh, sick loot, huh? As far as I know, this cave is relatively empty. Uh, maybe it's through here? No, it doesn't look like it. Let's fight this guy again. Now that we have a full party, this guy won't be an issue. Good night forever. And now the music has stopped. But we'll put it back on because I need some ambience. There's a guy up there, wasn't there? Yeah, right there. I, s I still see that motherfucker over there. Guess I can take a longer nap now. That guy was asleep. He, he slept through like us beating the ever-loving shit out of him. Now that's, that's a fucking hard sleeper if I've ever seen one. Turn back. Uh, yeah, I'll be fine.
Hey, how'd you find us? Must be a pretty smooth guy. I like that. Alright, cool. The worst thing about there being no more women is that there'll be no more kids. Yeah, I mean, it's kind of why the apocalypse is happening. You know, the human population is slowly dwindling. In, uh. <laughs> Wanna sleep here, buddy? I'll watch over you for 10 magazines. No way, creep show. You don't know me. Not yet, anyway. And we're pretty good, so I don't think we need the inn, but I will remember that it is here. Don't mind our boss. He's inherited this gang from his brother, and he thinks the name is lame, so he acts tough. But we're harmless. Oh, okay. I guess that's the boss up there. We are the schoolboy shufflers. Mess with, us, mess with us, and you'll get to slip down. And I ain't talking detention. Well, you know, you can make it work. Schoolboy slippers or whatever. Wow, I'm honestly surprised you even found us in here. You must be really awesome at adventuring and stuff. Hmm, tell you what. Rando's army has set up a camp here to find that girl. They've cut off our links to the outside. If you can clear out all the Rando guys in this area, I'll let you pass. Beyond this point is the only generator within miles. It's loaded with gasoline. And you look like the kind of guy that sniffs gas. So, this is right up your alley. How about it? Kill the rando guys? Rock and roll. I think there's about four guys roaming the caves around here. Come back when they're all dead. Alright. So basically all I have to do is kill a bunch of those rando dudes. How the hell do I get out of here? Oh, yeah, this barrel. <laughs> Forgot it was there. Pick up that bottle. Alright, I think there's only one more rando dude I have to kill, and it was that dude who's chilling out. So, find that guy, kill him, come back, we can progress. Yeah, he's talking about entrance up to that area. Yeah, we need to get to that guy. I forgot how, though. Uh. Cigarette. Yeah, I think it's up through here. Yeah, whenever you hear this music playing, that means the area is safe and no harm can come to you. Yeah, this asshole. God damn it. Please don't mess with my corpse. Yeah, whatever, douchebag. How many mags do we have? 127? Pretty good. Alright, I have to kill you. So what you did to the other boys, and I don't want none of that. I'll tell you something good if you just leave me alone. Alright, tell me. Hairspray is very flammable. What? That's good advice. People with a lot of product in their hair are flammable. You had a deal. Sorry, pal. I've never done dropkick DWWA, so I'll do it just to show it off. Okay, who, who did I do that on? I never wanted this. Sorry, bud. Finger beam. One of uh, Nern's first offensive attacks. Anyway, I think that's all the rando dudes. So we can uh, get the hell out of here. And I'm surprised these guys were surprised that I found them. It's not like they're very well hidden. They're just like fucking right here. But are we... Eh, we're, we're still pretty good. Not 10 mags to rest, will we? Or 
right, all those rando nerds are dead. Wow, you actually did it. Well, see ya. Bye bye. Use the gas in the generator to make a firebomb? Hell yeah. Make as many of these as we can get. It's empty. Damn. Alright. We can go back now. I'd just rather fucking drop through here. Cause fuck that. There's a certain thing I want to kill. And it's through that snake area. The area I said we weren't strong enough to deal with yet, but now that we've leveled up a little bit, I feel like we can go through there now without too much issue. Uh, first we gotta go back through this fucking cave. Oh, you again, so spooky. Get out of here. Alright, Terry leveled up. Hype up. 10 mags. I appreciate the magazines we're getting from them, at least. Oh, are you fucking kidding me? Come on. Olan's pretty close to leveling up, so you know what, I'll walk around here a little bit more so we can kill one more enemy and be done with it. Come on, the one time I want an enemy to spawn, you don't give him to me. Come on. There it is. Oh, so I guess I should show off Nern's finger beam. Damn, pretty powerful actually. Alright, Olan leveled up, good. That's all I really wanted. Let's go ahead and save. And let's go through that snake area I've been dreading. Alright, this place. Turn back, strong men only. I think we're pretty strong. I think we're pretty tough. Alright, here's a fucking snake. Oh shit. Brad needs to use his horse stance, Terry. You can just do a knuckle drop. You can discuss techniques. And you can do a bomb arrow. Alright, Armstrong style. Uh, what's n Terry's new skill? Hype up. Send ravaging vibes to your friends with these awesome words. Sure, why not? Burn. Uh, you can do finger beam. You can do another bomb arrow. The snake bears its fangs. Alright, see, these guys ain't so bad. It's just they're kind of annoying. That's... Uh, we're kind of low on health, honestly. So, I think we'll just use a mystery jerky on Brad. One on, hold on, just to beef us up a little bit. Let's keep going. Alright, another one of you. Fight. Attack. Uh, knuckle drop. Powers finger beam, skills bomb arrow. Wreck. Apparently, I have another item in my inventory. Thanks, Steam. I'm very happy you let me know that. There's a man laying in the grass here. What did I do wrong? You did nothing wrong, friend. I just wanted the experience. I hope you understand that this is an RPG, and in an RPG I must level. We could rest here. Fuck it, let's do it.
There's a creepy fella. This guy doesn't do anything, he just looks weird. <laughs>